Uh, was lunar dust a problem in the in the lunar module between uh, ex EVAs or excursions, or during the EVAs themselves? Uh, the only time we noticed the dust in the lunar module was just after getting back in the cabin uh, after an EVA. Uh, then there was still some dust circulating in the atmosphere of the cabin after we repressurized before it was filtered out by the uh, lithium hydroxide canisters that were intended to filter out carbon dioxide, but they also acted as very good dust filters. S a lot of the dust, however, just uh, uh, went down to the floor and worked its way underneath what was literally a floorboard, a perforated floorboard, and was out of sight and out of mind uh, for most of the time. Now, we did have uh, some dust get on our uh, suit zippers, on the bearings of the suit, but we had a very uh, a systematic way of cleaning these and that did not turn out to be any kind of a problem with respect to leak, leak rate of the suit or anything like that. You could see scratches on the bearings of the suit, uh, but they were circumferential scratches. They, uh, they were not scratches that appeared to uh, cause any loss of, uh, significant loss of oxygen. The uh, uh, lunar rover on the, uh, during the uh, uh, EVAs operated very well did not have any uh, noticeable dust problems. Uh, the, uh, it, uh, the, all the bearings were hermetically sealed and there was never any indication that its performance was impacted by the dust. Uh, there uh, were a few tools, however, that were not sealed and when dust got into their working parts, they gradually bound up and, uh, and were not uh, operable. In, in no instance, though, did that cause any significant difficulty to our operations. It is a problem, though, long term uh, for any extended operations on the moon, it's going to have to be dealt with by what I like to call a layered defense against the dust. And it's primarily, I think, an, an engineering and operational uh, issue. For example, uh, on these long-term uh, stays on the moon, it would be desirable never to bring your suit into a habitat. And, and, and we need to learn how to design a suit that you can get in and out of while it's hanging on the outside of the habitat. And I, I think that that's going to be possible. Whether it will be done or not, we'll just have to wait and see.